Hello everyone, let's look at the steps to repair a Windows 11 installation using the DISM and the SFC command line tools. If your computer is acting up, you're noticing random errors and the device is slow, there are a number of things that can be the issue, but it can also be a problem with damaged system files and replacing them with good ones can resolve the issue. And you can fix this problem using the deployment image servicing and management tool also known as the ISM and the system file checker also known as the SFC command line tool. Okay, first open star and look for command prompt or the terminal. Right click on it and select the run signature option. And then we're going to run the DISM online cleanup image with the restore health option and then press enter. This might take some time to complete. Now, it is important to know that the DISM command has many different options that you can use. And in this case, we're using the restore health option that will scan the actual image on your computer and it will replace any damaged files. And in order to do that, the tool is going to use the Windows Update service in order to download the files that need to be replaced. So your computer needs to be connected to the internet in order for this command to complete successfully. Now, after several minutes, the process should complete and the output should read the operation completed successfully. Now, if that's not the case, you can use another command, but you will need to supply the Windows 11 ISO file for the version of Windows that you're running on your computer. So in this case, if you're running version 25H2, you can download the official ISO file from the official Microsoft website. And then from here, you just need to select the Windows 11 ISO and just continue with the on-screen directions. Choose the installation language, then click this button to save that file to your computer. I already have this image saved on my computer, so I don't need to download that image. And then what you need to do is just to go to the location where you save that file, right click on it and select the mount option. Now, after the ISO is mounted, make sure to confirm the drive letter, which in this case is D. You can see it right here and right here. Now in command prompt, now you want to run the DISM command just like before, but then we're going to add the source option with the path to the install that WIM image with the limited access option. And then the DISM command will use the image inside of the installation files in order to fix the system files inside of the image available on your computer. And this also might take some time. So you just need to press enter. Now, after you completed the process to repair the local image using the DISM command tool, we can use the system file checker command in order to use that image to repair the installation files of your current setup. And to do that, we just need to run the SFC scan now command. And as you can see in the message, this process can also take some time. Another thing that I wanted to point out is that if you're having issues running the system file checker, you may want to start your computer in safe mode and then run the same command from that environment. You can check the link in the description to find a tutorial on how to access Windows 11 in safe mode. And that's it. That is one way you can use to repair a Windows 11 installation if the problems are related to damaged system files. Again, this method is not meant to magically repair all the issues on the operating system, but it's one way that you can use in order to make sure that the setup has all the system files in good condition. And that's it. Now, remember to leave your comments, like the video, share it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you. And I would like to thank you for viewing.